Hello, I'm Dr. Jeffrey Whitman. Welcome to Key Whitman Eye Center. Today, Dr. Hawk and I are going to talk about the implantable contact lens, or ICL. When a patient is not a good candidate for LASIK or PRK because of the severity of their nearsighted condition, or simply because they just don't have enough corneal tissue to treat with the laser, the ICL is often a good option for patients. The best candidates are usually 18 to 40 years of age before the onset of any presbyopia. Unlike with LASIK or PRK, instead of treating the cornea or the outer layer of the eye, the ICL is inserted within the eye, just behind the iris, and in front of the natural crystalline lens of the eye. You will arrive at the surgery center at the time of your scheduled appointment. You will have to have someone with you who can remain during the surgery and be able to drive you home afterwards. Please let your driver know that they will be needed for at least two hours. If you are scheduled for surgery before noon, you will not be allowed to eat or drink anything after midnight the night prior to your surgery. If your procedure is scheduled in the afternoon, you will be allowed to have a light breakfast, but only before 7 a.m. If you need to take any daily medication prior to your surgery arrival time, please either wait until after surgery or take it with a small sip of water. Ask our staff about what should or should not be taken prior to your procedure. You need to dress comfortably with a top that buttons up the front, and please leave all jewelry and other valuables at home. As you are called back into the pre-op area, you will be asked to lie down on a comfortable surgical bed where you will remain until after your procedure. For your care and safety, we will monitor your heart rate, oxygen levels, and blood pressure throughout your stay. A nurse anesthetist will begin an IV and administer some medication to help you relax, but you will be awake and fully breathing on your own during the entire procedure. Simple eye drops are used to both dilate and numb your eyes for the ICL procedure. Soon you will be taken to the operating room where I will use a microscope to implant your ICL. You will leave the surgery center wearing some protective goggles and will be already able to see as the vision begins to improve. Once you get home, you should not experience much in the way of any discomfort. If you do, please call us right away. You will be asked to return the next day to check your vision and to review your post-operative instructions. Your vision should already be greatly improved. It is important to continue any medicated eye drops as directed to reduce inflammation and to prevent infection. Thank you for choosing Key Whitman for your vision correction procedure. We look forward to taking care of you.